Hello and one and all and welcome back to yet another movie review and it's yet another MCU movie. Hallelujah. It is the second one to come out this year. Uh, the newest in Phase 4, the 25th MCU film and that is Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. And this focus is on martial arts and as I said this is the newest M. So you movie in the series. Um, again, let me get the cast up. Um, I'm not gonna boot draw the names. The only one I can really say is Michelle Yaou because um, because I have seen her in other stuff. But the other cast I'm not gonna butcher because otherwise it's just just gonna take forever um to pronounce. Um, it's directed by uh uh Destin Daniel. Cretan. Hope I've pronounced his name right. And don't worry guys, this is going to have no spoilers at all whatsoever. So if you guys have not seen uh, shang the Legend of the Ten Rings, please do not worry. Um, this is going to be spoiler free. You are all safe here. And what can I tell you guys, this film is great. I love this movie. Um, this really surprised me in some ways. I had it was going to be some Doctor Strange um, vibes to it, but it also um, just pretty much uh, was a martial arts film. And I have seen some martial arts films before. I mean, wouldn't say I'm a huge fan of them, but I've seen some before like, um, like IP The Karate Kid and the first Rush Hour film. Um, would like to get into some more, and I have watched Enter the Dragon as well. But Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings is definitely one of the best I've seen. And this is by far one of the best solo uh, MCU films I have seen. Just, it really um, just blew me away, particularly with its uh, action sequences, um, like the bus scene, which you've probably seen the trailer from in the trailer by now, um, you know, the third and the, the first and third act um, are all action packed and they're perfect in their own way. I love how well it was directed. The action scenes were really well done, and overall, I just loved the acting for the most part and. At times as you're watching this, it kind of doesn't feel like an MCU, it feels like a spin-off to the MCU at points, although this is part of the MCU, it is, it does kind of still tell you, tell you that this feels like a spin-off movie, it feels like a standalone movie, and if they make any sequels, I'm, I'm still happy uh, to see them none of the less. Um, but the acting is great to say the least. Um, all the characters um, were great in here, um, and um, the really only problem I have with the movie, it's just one criticism, is that here and there the CGI um, kind of doesn't work in places, but overall that's just really it. I guess this is just a quick review on uh, Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. I don't really have much to say. This is coming from someone that has seen martial art films but not really a huge fan. But you know what? I kind of do enjoy some of the ones that I've seen and I definitely would like to watch some more. As I said before, I'm not going to butcher anyone's uh, name because I don't want to disrespect uh, myself for that and um, I just don't want to waste my time with it. But overall guys, I loved Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. It was a, a one of the big game changers for the MCU saga. And just overall I loved all the characters. Um, they were all great here and there. And Wong is in this movie. I think he was in the trailers. I think he was in the trailers, but yes, one is also great in here. 
and um just and guys stay for those uh post credit scenes stay for those um two post credit scenes they are worth it but overall that's my quick review and overall on my letter grade scale i'm going to give shang chi the legend of the ten rings an a there you go guys that was my review on shang chi and the legend of the ten rings comment down below let me know below what you thought of this movie also comment down below let me know what is your favorite martial arts movie let me know below in the comments and let's have a great discussion and guys i am back doing some bond i have two more just skyfall and spectre i am working on my review for skyfall hopefully by uh next weekend so stay tuned for that and as always, if you're new to my channel, I'm a movie reviewer from the UK that likes to review movies from time to time. And also classics, especially from time to time when a new movie comes out and on special occasions. But as always, please feel free to comment, like, subscribe, share this video and notify that bell before you leave. All of my social media links will be in the description down below. And as always, folks, until my next video, I shall see you then. And...